To high school football now, Iola was one of the best squads in the Brazos Valley a year ago. As KAG's Colin Deaver tells us, they could be even better in 2015. Iola's dream 2014 season came to an unfortunate end on an early December night at the hands of Tenaha. Despite a late rally, the Bulldogs fell short in a 35-28 defeat in the state quarterfinals. That loss has motivated Iola all offseason, and with 17 starters returning, they're experienced and ready to prove themselves again. Something that you know had something to do with our loss in that last game is just being there for the first time that deep in quite a while. Uh, but now our kids know how to deal with that pressure and that adversity, and we feel like that can pay off for us a lot this year. What's a lot of guys returning, we don't have to teach them as much, and they already know how to do everything already, so we don't have to throw everything in. We can get, we're a lot further along already. Leading the way for the Bulldogs in 2015 will be a loaded defense spearheaded by All-State selection Ryan Rennick. It's an experienced unit that allowed more than 20 points just twice last year. Defensively, we're returning 10 starters. Uh, most of those kids still pretty young, uh, but we're excited about that, and we feel like we can hang our hat on the defense. Iola's main concern this season will be replacing star quarterback Hayden Martinez. The signal caller ran for over 2,000 yards in 2015 and is a huge loss. Ready, go. In his place steps Will Neville, a guy the coaching staff is excited about. He'll also have talented skill players to help him get acclimated. He's not new to the quarterback position. He's always worked as a quarterback, and so we're very confident in Will and what he can do for us uh, and the added dimension that he can bring to us offensively. They know how much we have coming back and the success we can build off of and the success we had last year. I think we can build off that and do better. The Bulldogs' quest for another great season gets rolling August 28th against Somerville. For KAG Sports, I'm Colin Deaver. Again, Iola is coming off a stellar 11-1 and season and a trip to the state quarterfinals. With that many starters coming back, fourth-year head coach Pete Martinez and company should be set to go again, of course, this year in 2015.